do for the city? Um, a little bit of survey, a little bit of design, a little bit of uh, everything. I'm an engineering aide. Okay, and you've been with the city for how long? Uh, coming up in July, 35 years. Okay, and so this is your first um, project with this particular type of remediation? No, I've been doing this for 10 years. Oh, okay. David, why don't you say a little bit about your company? Sure. Um, CRC Concrete Raising is actually the home office of a number of different franchise locations throughout the United States. We conduct this type of work on a regular basis for residential, commercial, industrial, and of course municipal. Um, basically it started in 1947 as a process of alleviating the cost of tear out and replacement when the concrete was structurally sound and was just uh, settled as a matter of subgrade that had failed or was poorly compacted at time of pour. From that, we've, uh, we've established ourselves as the innovative company in concrete raising. You can see we've gone the route of modifying volumetric mixers so that we differentiate ourselves from common mud jackets. What we're looking to accomplish is a calibrated cement grout that will completely fill the void in a liquid state but start to set prior to any sort of shrinkage which would occur if we were just uh, putting limestone in water or topsoil in water beneath the concrete. And you like this solution because? Uh, because the uh, right now we're getting this for approximately uh, eight and a quarter a lineal foot. Uh, removal and replacement uh, can go anywhere from uh, $30 a foot up to uh, probably about 120, depending on uh, how much you're uh, you're uh, reconstructing. So, and you you've been using this solution for 10 years? Uh, yeah, actually, I believe uh, the first I was introduced was to uh, the Concrete Raising Corporation. Uh, previous, uh, uh, previous people to me. <laughs> have. Uh, were actually the ones that showed me how to do this and uh, the advantage of it. Public Works uh, engineers and officials do appreciate is the fact that it's not real invasive. Right. It is environmentally friendly in that we don't have to contract individuals to break up the curb in this example, take it to a recycling plant or a landfill, which it's not biodegradable material, and we don't have to worry about the additional fuel emissions, labor costs, um, and of course the trenching and re-landscaping or environmental work that would follow pouring of new concrete. If it's broken up, by all means. There's a driveway, two driveways behind you that is too cracked up. Tear it out, replace it. But if it's structurally sound, why wouldn't you just want to raise it back up to its intended level grade? I think Vicki was mentioning you have agreements with certain cement suppliers. We, uh, we, we simply have ready mix plants that fill us the same as, as a concrete contractor or okay. a cement contractor. Um, our big thing is just that we're using a, a cement grout. Don't get me wrong, if a utility has to come in, they will know we've been there. Mm -hmm. But whereas normal concrete will set up, at, uh, depending upon the application in specifications anywhere from 4,000 to uh, 7, 8,000 PSI. Our material generally sets up on a national basis right around 800 to 1,000 PSI. So will they know we've been there? Yes, but it's not like we're putting cement on top of cement or concrete on top of concrete. Okay. That way we would just overburden that soil and we wouldn't accomplish the ability to raise and guarantee it for, in our case, four years. Okay. Some of the ponding. Wait a minute. Um, uh, David sorry. said you can see some of the settlement and the ponding. And some of the ponding that has occurred here. Now these have been drilled. We have a driller that uh, is drilling holes so that our material can obviously submerge itself 
Yeah. And by methodology of uh, hydraulic lifting, we'll just hydraulically, hydraulic force will cause this actually to float up if you can envision it. And we're just floating it back up to its intended grade. Our material that we pump, I'll take you over there when you're done. Go 